Damn it, bastard! I'll blow your head off! Let's storm in! He's just one man, we can take him! I may be one man, but I'm one Irishman! Which is, like, ten normal men and twenty Englishmen! We got a lot more than ten, even more than twenty here! Alright! Nobody wants to die here today! And I got a belt full of ammo! And I'll put a gold of lead in the next giggling horde that comes around that corner! Now just hear my side of the story, gentlemen. Hear my side of the story first. Just hear me out, and then you can decide if you want to go about your lynching or not. Well, I'll take your silence as an invitation to continue. What happened between me and the colonel was no underhanded back shooting. What happened between me and the colonel was just as law-abiding as what your gentlemen are doing now. It all started, I'll admit, when I was poaching rabbits. I know it's not the luxurious place we had back east, but it's a nice plot of land. We're self-sustaining. Give it a couple weeks. What are you doing on my land? Oh, this is your land, sir. Great, great. Well, I apologize for trespassing. But if you come with me, I think you'll forget about my little crime here. You see, I was walking along your fence line, and I saw a peninsula bighorn ram resting under your tree. Which is quite remarkable, considering the only bighorn ram you find around these parts is the Autobahn ram. So I shot it dead. Only took me one bullet to dead. Now you see, the pelt of this ram will sell for quite the pretty penny. But, seeing as this is your land, then the task of skinning and tanning such a beast is far too difficult for a wee little Irishman like me. Now, if you follow me, sir, I'll take you to the ram, and then me and you can make some money off it. What do you say? Seems like it's worth checking out. Stay here, dear. We'll be right back. Oh, I swear to God. Morning. There we go. Can't have you sneaking this out. Am I right? So I tied him to the tree, and then I ran to fetch his wife. What is this? This is your husband, the war hero. Tied up to a tree. Tied up to a tree by me, Montana's Irish bandit. He snuck up behind me. He let me sneak up behind him. Oh, Colonel. Sherman's fighting, Colonel. I fought in the war too, you know. Came right off the boat and I put a rifle in my hand. Well, your Civil War and your General Sherman taught me one very important thing, Colonel. To the victor go the spoils. Isn't that so? You see what I did to her mister there? I'd hate to do the same thing to such a pretty lady. Wait now, miss. I wouldn't do that if I were you. I could put a bullet in your husband's heart from right here. But I'm a good guy, pure in heart and all that. And I'll spare him. 
if you'll let me. What do you want? Money? <laughs> I could have plundered your farmhouse while you were out tending crops if it was money I was after. Son of a bitch! I'm not true with my story, you damn bloody cocks. A deal is a deal, now let me finish. Sheesh. Well, Colonel, it's been a pleasure. The lovely young miss and I have decided that, that we don't really need you anymore. Now, I'm not gonna kill you, I'm just gonna leave you tied to this tree. I'm sure someone will find you. <laughs> no! Eh? It would be a damn sight and proper for a lady to be sporting two misters. What exactly are you saying? I'm saying one of you needs to kill the other. That's the only way I'll leave with you. I don't really think you're worth killing for, my dear. Oh, don't worry. I'll be the one doing the killing. I'll cut you free, and then we'll have a duel. To the victor go the spoils. If you do win, though, you might want to straighten her out. So I caught them free, and there we were. That's how you say it happened, Irish. Don't sound right, though. Well, I'm sorry I couldn't fulfill your desired criteria, mate, but that's how it happened. Tell me, what did the wife tell you? What's her story? I could have plundered your farmhouse while you were out tending crops. It was money I was after. Son of a bitch! She said, Christ, at least my story had a dying like a man. <laughs> <laughs>